I'd like you to meet some very dear friends of mine. This is Jesse Barnes. Jesse's worked in the top nightclubs in the country in service. Phil is one of the fastest bartenders I've ever seen. Phil is gonna work with you guys behind the bar as Jesse works on service. I wanna leave you with something. This is the monument to your failure. The sickle. That's who you are. But that's not who you have to be. Okay, let's do this, let's go to work. What I see right now is the bartender skills are not up to par. They're not making multiple drinks. The technical part of things is just not there right now, and that's gonna be really hard to do because we don't have a lot of time to do it. All right, guys, here we go. So I'm gonna give you an example of true shake where you're actually binding all the ingredients together, not a roll or a dump, which I saw you guys do it a lot last night. You get there and you shake it and you bring life to it. You build it up. Now, what's this doing is anytime you use anything that's citrus, like a sour, a lemon, a lime, you need to dilute that with, with the shake, with the ice, with the water. And just visually, you can see the difference in the drink. So last night, you guys were making one drink at a time, and then one drink at a time, and then one drink at a time. So what I'm gonna do to start off with you guys, I'm just gonna show you a little bit of multitasking on how to make three drinks at one time, okay? So we have one drink that's just a straight drink and a mixer, and then we have two drinks that are very, very similar, right? Boom, boom, and boom. Whiskey ginger, fuzzy navel, sex on the beach. How long do you think that took to make? 45 seconds. If that, right? See how simple that was? Sweet, why is that faster than grabbing the two bottles, doing the liquor in both, and then taking the gun and doing both? So what's happening with this drink that you finished making already before you finished off these drinks? It's dying. It's already started to get watered down. It's already started to dilute. You know how long it takes for a drink to die? Two minutes. So you don't want to make that drink and then go and make these other drinks first. You try to knock them all out at the same time so you can deliver them all at the same time so they get the freshest possible drinks. I'm never going to do it the way that you did. Really? When I'm behind the bar making regular drinks, not having to do special technique. I'm a high ringer. You what's, can't tell wait, me my what, what's special technique? Well, the whole stirring thing, the pouring over the ice. Stirring? Trying... No, I'm just saying. I sent 100 people in this bar last night. You made drinks one at a time. You never even put two glasses up there at once. Those are techniques that a bartender, everybody should know. I'm just saying that I'm not used to using. So not the more you speak, to... the more of a fool you look like. I don't bring the register. I don't bartender.